Question 16. During a game of bowls both seconds play their bowls. When one of the lead states I've only played one bowl. This is verified and the umpire is asked what action should be taken. What ruling should the umpire give? Answer. Law 16 where a player has played out of order and the mistake is not detected until after the next bowl is bowled the end shall be declared dead. Question 17. In a game of pose it is the skip's turn to bowl. It is then noticed that the yellow skip has an extra bowl. The yellow second then realizes that they had only played one bowl. This is verified and the umpire is called to resolve the issue. What ruling should the umpire give? Answer. Law 16 where a player has played out of order and the mistake is not detected until after the next bowl is bowled the end shall be declared dead. Question 18. A player in a game of singles realizes that they have just bowled the wrong colored ball, the opponent's ball. The player immediately picks up one of their own balls and goes to the head to make a replacement. What is the correct procedure in this situation? Answer. Law 17. If a player bowls an opponent's ball by mistake it shall, after it has come to rest, be replaced by one of the correct color, the replacement being made by the non-offending player in singles or by a member of the non-offending team. Question 19. The black player in a game of singles delivers a ball. It is then realized that a yellow ball has been delivered by mistake. The non-offending yellow player hands a black ball to the marker who changes the ball. What is the correct procedure in this situation? Answer. Law 17. If a player bowls an opponent's ball by mistake it shall, after it has come to rest, be replaced by one of the correct color, the replacement being made by the non-offending player in singles or by a member of the non-offending team. Question 20. In a game of foes, a ball is played out of order by the black third and the head is disturbed. The mistake is detected before the next ball is delivered and the yellow skip elects to replace the head and return the ball to be replayed in its proper order. The black skip calls the umpire and complains that the head has not been restored fairly to its previous position. What decision should the umpire make? Answer. Law 18. The player, who has the right to replace the jack, a ball, or the head, shall be the sole judge of the previous position. Question 21. In a game of singles the umpire orders the stopping of a ball, but the ball disturbs the head before it can be stopped. The non-offending player elects to replace the head. The offending player complains to the umpire that the head has not been restored fairly to its previous position. What decision should the umpire make? Answer. Law 18. The player, who has the right to replace the jack, a ball, or the head, shall be the sole judge of the previous position. Question 22. In a game of foes the yellow third plays a ball that strikes the head. A ball in the head is broken and the head is disturbed. What should happen now? Answer. Law 19. C. Should a ball break or be damaged after striking the jack or any ball in the head? Or should any ball in the head break or be damaged as a result of being struck by any ball or jack in play? Another ball shall be substituted for that ball. The opposing players in singles or the skips or delegated player slash s shall agree on the previous position position of the head, failing agreement the end shall be dead. Question 23. An end is declared dead, but before it can be replayed the finishing time signal sounds. What should happen now? Answer. Law 21. In the event of an end being declared dead, it shall be replayed from the same bowling area and the order of play shall be the same as for the end declared dead. Question 24. The last end of a game of foes was killed and a final end is being played following a burned ball incident. This end is declared dead. What should happen now? Answer. Law 21. In the event of an end being declared dead, it shall be replayed from the same bowling area and the order of play shall be the same as for the end declared dead. Question 25. After a drive into the head, the jack rebounds back up the mat and comes to rest on the mat midway between the bowling area and the one-third mark from the bowling end. What should happen now? Answer. Law 22. D. Should the jack in play rebound down the mat to come to rest less than wholly past the one-third marks from the bowling end, the end shall be dead. Question 26. In a game of foes the black third delivers a ball that comes to rest partly on the mat but also touching the floor at the far end of the mat. The yellow third then plays a ball that causes the jack to strike the black third's pole, which is partly on the mat. The jack is moved from its previous position but is still in play. The skips now realize what has occurred and seek the umpire's advice. What should the umpire tell the skips? Answer. Law 22. C. A ball partly on the mat but touching the floor shall be 
be dead. Law 22. E. All dead balls shall be removed from the mat by either player on the head or the umpire or when requested. The marker. See marker's duties. Law 22. F. In the event of an omission to do so, the jack or any bowl coming in contact with any such dead bowl or bowls shall remain where it comes to rest. All dead bowls shall then be removed from the mat. Question 27. In a game of singles the players go to the head to decide the score. A counting bowl is removed from the head when it is realized that there is still a bowl to be played. What is the correct procedure in this situation? Answer. Law 23. E. If any counting bowl has been removed from the head when there is still a bowl to be played the unplayed bowl shall be forfeited if it belongs to the skip of the offending team. If the unplayed bowl belongs to the skip of the non-offending team any removed bowl shall be burned and the unplayed bowl played. Law 30, A. Question 28. An end has been concluded and the measurers are deciding the score. One skip walks down the mat to the head and is commenting on the scoring. An umpire sees this happen. What should the umpire tell the skip? Answer. Law 23. F. The skips shall remain at the bowling end and no other person other than the measurers shall be on the mat or comment in any way while the score is being decided. Question 29. An end is concluded with a measure being required. The measurer, who played the last bowl, measures first. The other measurer does not agree and calls the umpire. The first measurer complains to the umpire that the second measurer should also have measured before calling the umpire. What should the umpire tell the players? Answer. Law 23. G. When a measure is required the measurer who played the last bowl shall, unless exempted, measure first. If not satisfied the other measurer may then measure and or call the umpire or duty measurer. Question 30. In a singles game measuring has commenced when it is discovered there is still a bowl to be played. You, the umpire, is appealed to. What is your decision? Answer. Law 24. B. I. Where a measure has commenced any unplayed bowl shall be forfeited. 